What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to Tech and Tactical. Um, I wanted to do a uh, quick look at my new Maxpedition Micro. Um, I did get the Fatty a while back, and I just love it. So I wanted to kind of do some comparisons so you guys could, uh, you know, see what you think between the two. You know, the Fatty is called a Fatty actually because of how deep it is. You know, how thick it is. So there you go, a little side shot there. But uh, let's get up on the table and I'll open these puppies up. All right, and here they are side by side. Um, this is the one that I've been carrying around for a few, actually a couple months almost, a little over a month, almost two months. Um, and, you know, I really like it. It's just really big is the problem. I mean, this thing is huge, honestly. Um, so I wanted to get a, and I like that it's big, but that's not, it's called a pocket organizer, but that's not going in any pocket that I have. Um, so I wanted to get, uh, the micro, which is the little one. This is the smallest one that they, that they got. And this thing will definitely fit in every one of my pockets. I've actually tried it now to be, I am six one and like 215 pounds. So obviously if you're a small person or, you know, or especially like a small female or whatever, and you, and you wear, you know, clothes that don't have big pockets in them, you might not be able to fit this in your pocket, but I can comfortably fit it into my work front and back pockets, you know, pants, work pants, front and back pockets, and then my casual jeans, khakis, etc. cetera, uh, it fits into all, you know, any of my pockets as well. So this is, um, you know, if it's packed full, it's a little heavy, you know, to pay it, but you know, you go by the situation, you know, where are you going with it? What are you doing with it? Um, so, uh, let's open her up. So if you're comparing this to other Maxpedition pocket organizers, there are a couple of differences. This is the smallest one, um, and it's there's a couple of uh, dis you know distinctions. The full size ones have got Velcro on the front uh, pocket here. They've got a Velcro patch, you know, place for a Velcro patch, like a morale patch. Or, or a distinction patch. If you want to make it a med kit, you would put, you know, like a, a medical symbol. And these also have, the bigger ones, have two zippers and Molly compatible webbing on the back. Okay, so this doesn't have any of that. It, well, it's got, you know, it's got one zipper, um, which is good. I mean, it's this the whole idea of this one, I think, is to make, you know, keep the weight down or whatever. So it's got one zipper. It does not have a, pa a place for a patch. It does not have... Um, uh, Velcro here. And honestly, I like this better without the Velcro. And of course there's not enough room for a patch. So the idea is it's kind of too small to require these things. I do kind of wish it had the Molly, but I guess it would make it a little thicker and a little heavier. So here's mine and you can set these up however you want. Um, this is my EDC at the moment. You know, I might turn this into a mini fire kit. You know, there's a, I've got a lot of ideas for what I want to do with this, but uh, at the moment, this is uh, my EDC. So it's my daily carry knife, which most of the time this knife is not in here. It's on my belt. Um, you know, I, I wear this thing on my, on my side, uh, but that's, you know, Ontario Rat 1 in D2 steel. Um, but anyway, the there is a review for that, by the way, on this channel. Um, go back a few videos. Uh, I've got a pen with ru uh, rubber bands. I do like to multi-use stuff. So I like to have, and this is a Bic, I think, because you need a short one to fit in here. And you can see it literally, you can't fit a bigger pen. That's about the biggest pen. Um, you know, the, the sharp, that Sharpie is barely squeezing in there. But uh, I like to have multi-use items. So this is a, a pen, but it's also got uh, rubber bands. Um, you know, you, your chapstick of choice. You know, it's, it's winter right now, um, you know, but, uh, right, you know, so I, I would put chapstick in here. Maybe during the summer, it wouldn't be chapstick. It might be something different. Um, and I've got a replacement battery, uh, AAA for the Streamlight MicroStream. Um, so this is something I recently acquired and, um, I don't know how I feel about it. I'm not sure if I love it. Um, I mean, I'll do a, I'll do a review. I don't want to get too deep into it. I, there's a stuff I do like about it. Um, you know, that pocket clip is fantastic, especially to put on a hat, you know, clips right on. And then, um, you know, this is just really stiff, but it's nice and bright, you know, certainly for the, the power, you know, it's a, th uh, one triple a battery. 
you know, it's not going to put out much. Um, and then I've got a, sh I, I try to always have one of these in my kits, Sharpie with uh, Gorilla Tape. You know, Gorilla Tape's the best type of tape there is um, for my uses, you know, for maybe like daily use and bushcrafty stuff too. Um, you know, that's got a lot of uses. Not bushcrafty stuff, sorry. I was just reading the um, another one of those bushcraft books. Um, and then, I, you know, my favorite lighter, a clipper. Uh, I've, you know, I might even do a whole video just on clippers. I love these lighters. You know, there's so many benefits. I, I, um, you know, right out of the gate, it's kind of cool. If, uh, you can pull this, this flint, you know, the flint, the, um, striker out and actually, um, use it on its own, like in a micro kit. Um, but you can replace some, I mean, these things are really cool. They're refillable. But, um, and then I've, again, I've got another multi-use item here. You know, you've got your, uh, um, that's actually a hair tie, which are really great for, um, holding stuff together that you don't want to like damage, um, you know, stuff you don't want to, uh, like a, like a, a rubber band, uh, doubled over will, will tear at something. I guess that's the whole idea, you know, for people with long hair use these, but anyway, um, and then this is really cool. I've got a makeshift wallet. You know, so, and I'm sorry, I, I don't mean to sponsor any of this, these people, but I'm a uh, realtor and I always get like, you know, all this uh, stuff from them. But anyway, uh, this is really cool because this is a little makeshift wallet. And, um, you know, if I'm going somewhere and I don't want to carry my wallet, I can, you know, put a ton of stuff in here. I can put like, two, I can, I can put my driver's license, a credit card and a little, you know, like maybe a 40 bucks or something. Um, so that's great. Next slides, you know, I, I like right in here. So there's, you know, if I, if I want, if I really wanted to, I could get rid of my wallet. Um, not permanently, but you know, if I was going somewhere, uh, wearing, you know, I was going to the gym or something, or I was going to the beach, you know, somewhere where I'm not going to have a bunch of pockets. But anyway, I always try to uh, keep one of, uh, one or two of these on me. Um, so that's all I was in, that's in the back there. I think that's it. And then over here, um, I've got one of these cloths again. I think I showed you guys in the other video. I love, uh, when you go into a, like an expensive hotel or, or restaurant or something, they've got these like heavy duty disposable cloths. And then I've got, um, I've got, you know, painkillers and vitamins and stuff too. So, you know, and then I might, and then, and, uh, um, a, uh, a paper clip. So I really like these things. I think, you know, I, I just like keeping the stuff, the stuff organized like this. I think that these do a great job. You've got a little, uh, lanyard thing here as well. Um, so yeah, I mean, but this one isn't packed super full because I don't want this one to be real heavy and big. It's just kind of big enough to, you know, hold my essentials basically. Um, you know, if you throw all that stuff into your pocket, you know, um, yeah, maybe not that, but you get the idea. If you toss all that stuff in, into your pockets, you're going to, you, you got a lot of crap on you. But, um, yeah, so I, I would say I, overall, I really like this thing. Um, the mint, the micro, uh, I still, I probably, you know, look at the fat, like the fatio, you can load some gear into one of these things. Um, I've got a review for this one, uh, on the, ch on this channel. I also have a review for the rat model one in D2 steel on this channel. So go back and take a look. Uh, thanks for stopping by uh, Tech and Tactical. Please like and subscribe.